The Romanian Vampire Legend. The Story of the Strigoi. In the shadowed corners of Romanian folklore lies a creature of dread and intrigue. The Strigoi. These entities are more than mere figments of imagination. They are deeply rooted in the cultural and historical tapestry of Romania, embodying ancient fears and superstitions. The Strigoi are considered to be the undead, much like Western vampires, but with distinct characteristics that set them apart. To understand the Strigoi, one must delve into the annals of Romanian history, where myths and realities intertwine. The origins of the Strigoi are shrouded in mystery, with various accounts suggesting different beginnings. Some sources trace the legend back to ancient pre-Christian times, where it is believed that the Strigoi emerged from the ancient Slavic beliefs in the undead. In these early stories, the Strigoi were thought to be spirits of the deceased, who had not found peace and returned to the mortal realm to seek vengeance or fulfill unfinished business. This portrayal aligns with the broader concept of revenants found in various cultures, where the dead are believed to return to the world of the living. Romanian folklore describes the Strigoi as having the ability to transform into animals, particularly wolves or bats, which is a trait shared with other vampire myths. Unlike the more familiar Dracula-esque vampire with its bloodlust and aristocratic demeanor, the Strigoi are often depicted as ghastly, spectral figures with a more primal connection to the earth and its dark forces. Their appearance is said to be ghastly, with decayed or corpse-like features, which only adds to their terrorizing presence. In traditional Romanian villages, the belief in the Strigoi was so strong that it influenced burial practices. People would go to great lengths to prevent the dead from rising. This included placing heavy stones on the graves, driving iron stakes through the bodies, and performing various rituals to ensure that the deceased did not become a Strigoi. The fear of becoming a Strigoi was particularly strong among those who had died under unusual or violent circumstances, as these individuals were believed to be more likely to return from the grave. Stories about the Strigoi were passed down through generations often embellished and adapted to reflect the social and cultural context of the time. The oral tradition played a crucial role in preserving these tales, with each retelling adding layers of complexity and horror. As Romania entered the modern era, the tales of the Strigoi continued to evolve, blending with contemporary vampire legends and influencing the broader understanding of vampiric lore. The Strigoi are not merely figments of folklore, but are deeply embedded in Romanian traditions and rituals. To understand the full impact of the Strigoi on Romanian culture, one must examine the various practices that were believed to ward off or combat these fearsome beings. The rituals performed by the living to protect themselves from the Strigoi reveal much about the fears and beliefs of the time. One of the most significant rituals was the practice of staking the deceased. This was believed to prevent the deceased from rising as a Strigoi. Villagers would drive a wooden stake through the heart of the corpse, a practice reminiscent of vampire lore found in other cultures. Additionally, iron objects were often placed on or around the grave to repel the Strigoi. Iron was considered a protective substance with the power to ward off evil spirits. Another common practice was the exhumation of bodies to check for signs of vampirism. In cases where death was unexpected or unnatural, the body would be dug up to inspect it for signs of the Strigoi. This could include looking for signs of decomposition or unusual physical features. If any signs were found, the body would be subjected to various rituals to ensure it would not rise as a Strigoi. These rituals often involved burning the corpse or performing elaborate ceremonies to cleanse the spirit. The Strigoi were also believed to have the power to curse the living. People who were afflicted by mysterious ailments or misfortunes were sometimes thought to be under the influence of a Strigoi. In these cases, special rituals and protective charms were used to ward off the malevolent spirit. Amulets, charms, and prayers were common tools in this battle against supernatural forces. These rituals were deeply ingrained in the daily life of Romanian villagers, reflecting a pervasive belief in the power of the Strigoi. The influence of the Strigoi on local customs and practices cannot be overstated. The fear of becoming a Strigoi or falling victim to one shaped many aspects of Romanian life. From burial practices to daily rituals, the presence of the Strigoi was felt in various ways. Even as Romania modernized, 
the legends and rituals surrounding the Strigoi continued to influence the cultural landscape. As Romania moved into the 20th and 21st centuries, the legend of the Strigoi did not fade away, but instead evolved and adapted to new cultural contexts. The traditional fears and superstitions surrounding the Strigoi found new expression in literature, film, and popular media. This evolution reflects the enduring nature of the Strigoi myth and its ability to resonate with contemporary audiences. In literature, the Strigoi have been featured in various works that explore their dark and mysterious nature. Writers have drawn upon the traditional folklore to create compelling narratives that blend historical elements with contemporary storytelling. These works often explore themes of death, resurrection, and the supernatural, using the Strigoi as a symbol of ancient fears and desires. The influence of the Strigoi can also be seen in Romanian cinema and television. Filmmakers and screenwriters have adapted the traditional vampire myths to create modern horror stories that incorporate elements of the Strigoi legend. These adaptations often blend traditional folklore with contemporary horror tropes, creating a unique and intriguing cinematic experience. The Strigoi have also made their way into popular culture beyond Romania. International audiences have been introduced to the Strigoi through various media, including books, films, and television shows. The global fascination with vampire legends has led to a broader interest in the Strigoi and other vampire myths from around the world. This cross-cultural exchange has enriched the understanding of vampire lore and highlighted the connections between different vampire traditions. Despite the changes and adaptations, the core elements of the Strigoi legend remain intact. The fear of the undead, the belief in supernatural forces, and the desire to protect oneself from evil spirits continue to resonate with audiences. The Strigoi legend serves as a reminder of the power of folklore and its ability to capture the imagination across time and space. The legend of the Strigoi is not merely confined to the realm of folklore. It has also been intertwined with historical accounts and real-life incidents. Throughout Romanian history, there have been numerous reports of encounters with these dreaded beings. These accounts often blur the line between myth and reality providing a fascinating glimpse into how fear and superstition influenced people's lives. One of the most notable cases of Strigoi sightings occurred in the early 19th century in the village of Manisiu. Reports from the time describe a series of mysterious deaths and disturbances that the local population attributed to a Strigoi. According to the accounts, the village was plagued by a series of inexplicable events. Livestock were found mutilated, people reported hearing strange noises at night, and several villagers fell ill under mysterious circumstances. The situation reached a boiling point when a local man, Ion Popescu, was found dead under suspicious circumstances. His body showed signs of violent struggle and appeared to have been drained of blood. The villagers, convinced that a Strigoi was responsible, performed a series of rituals to identify and combat the malevolent entity. They exhumed several bodies from the local cemetery, searching for signs of vampirism. One body, in particular, drew their attention. A deceased man, who had been buried only a few months prior. His body was found to be unusually preserved, and the villagers believed this to be a clear indication of Strigoi activity. The man's grave was dug up, and a wooden stake was driven through his heart as a preventive measure. This dramatic action is a testament to the depth of belief in Strigoi, and the extreme measures people were willing to take to protect themselves. Historical records also provide evidence of similar encounters. The 18th century saw a rise in reports of vampire sightings in the region, with several cases documented by local historians. These accounts often detail encounters with entities believed to be Strigoi, including sightings of ghostly figures and reports of attacks on livestock and humans. These historical cases offer valuable insight into how deeply ingrained the belief in the Strigoi was in Romanian society. The significance of these historical encounters lies not only in their immediate impact, but also in their role in shaping the folklore surrounding the Strigoi. Each reported case added to the growing body of stories and beliefs, reinforcing the idea of the Strigoi as a tangible threat. These accounts also illustrate how folklore and superstition were intertwined with daily life, influencing people's understanding of the world around them. The Strigoi have left an indelible mark on Romanian culture, influencing various aspects of life and customs. The fear of these undead beings has shaped not only burial practices, but also local traditions, festivals, and even cuisine.
The Strigoi have also influenced Romanian festivals and celebrations. Some local festivals, particularly those held around the time of the winter solstice, incorporate elements of vampire folklore. These festivals often feature rituals and performances intended to ward off evil spirits and protect against the Strigoi. For example, during the Festival of the Dead, which is celebrated in various parts of Romania, participants perform rituals to honor the deceased and protect themselves from supernatural threats. The presence of the Strigoi in these celebrations underscores the enduring influence of vampire folklore on Romanian culture. Cuisine has not escaped the influence of the Strigoi either. Traditional Romanian dishes often include ingredients and preparations believed to have protective properties against evil spirits. Garlic, for example, is a common ingredient in Romanian cuisine and is thought to ward off vampires and other malevolent beings. The use of garlic in cooking reflects the cultural belief in its protective qualities and its role in combating supernatural threats. The Strigoi have also influenced local storytelling and entertainment. Folk tales and legends about the Strigoi are passed down through generations, often retold during gatherings and festivals. These stories serve as both entertainment and a means of preserving cultural heritage. The enduring popularity of Strigoi legends in literature and media further illustrates their impact on Romanian culture. In contemporary Romania, the legend of the Strigoi continues to hold a place of significance, despite the country's modernization and urbanization. The belief in these supernatural beings persists among some segments of the population, reflecting the enduring nature of folklore and its ability to adapt to changing times. Modern Romania has seen a resurgence of interest in traditional folklore, including the Strigoi legend. This renewed interest is driven in part by cultural preservation efforts and a desire to reconnect with Romania's rich historical heritage. Folk festivals, cultural events, and educational programs often feature elements of the Strigoi legend, providing a platform for the continued exploration and celebration of this aspect of Romanian culture. Despite the advances of modern science and rationality, belief in the Strigoi persists in some rural areas. Traditional practices and rituals associated with the Strigoi are still observed by those who adhere to old beliefs. These practices may include rituals to protect against supernatural threats, such as the use of garlic and iron objects. The continued observance of these rituals highlights the enduring nature of folklore and its role in shaping cultural identity. Popular culture has also played a role in keeping the Strigoi legend alive. Romanian literature, cinema, and television often incorporate elements of vampire folklore, including the Strigoi. These modern adaptations reflect the enduring fascination with the supernatural and the ways in which traditional stories continue to captivate contemporary audiences. The portrayal of the Strigoi in modern media helps to keep the legend relevant and accessible to new generations. The Strigoi legend also serves as a reminder of the power of folklore to shape cultural perceptions and beliefs. The persistence of the Strigoi myth demonstrates the ways in which traditional stories can continue to influence and resonate with people even in a rapidly changing world. The Strigoi remain a symbol of the supernatural and a testament to the rich cultural heritage of Romania. The Strigoi have been a prominent figure in Romanian folktales and literature for centuries. These stories, passed down through generations, have shaped the collective imagination and provided a framework for understanding the supernatural. The depiction of the Strigoi in folktales often reflects the fears, morals, and cultural values of Romanian society. Folktales about the Strigoi frequently portray them as malevolent spirits who prey on the living. These tales often involve themes of betrayal, revenge, and the supernatural. One popular folktale tells the story of a Strigoi, who was once a powerful nobleman betrayed by his closest allies. Seeking revenge, the Strigoi returns from the grave to torment those who wronged him. This tale reflects common themes in Romanian folklore, where betrayal and retribution are central motifs. Another common motif in Strigoi stories is the struggle between the living and the undead. In many tales, heroes or protagonists must confront the Strigoi to protect their families and communities. These stories often involve quests, magical objects, and rituals designed to combat the Strigoi's powers. For example, a popular tale recounts the story of a young hero who, armed with a magical sword, must venture into the realm of the Strigoi to save his village from a vampire lord. Romanian literature has also been influenced by the Strigoi legend. 
writers have drawn on the folklore to create compelling narratives that explore themes of darkness, transformation, and the supernatural. The Strigoi often serve as symbols of fear and the unknown, providing a backdrop for exploring deeper psychological and existential issues. One notable example is the work of Romanian author Mihail Sadoveanu, whose stories frequently incorporate elements of Romanian folklore, including the Strigoi. Sadoveanu's use of the Strigoi legend reflects his interest in blending traditional stories with modern literary techniques. His works capture the eerie and unsettling atmosphere of the Strigoi legend, while also exploring themes of human nature and the supernatural. Contemporary Romanian literature and media continue to draw on the Strigoi legend, often reimagining it in new and innovative ways. Modern adaptations may blend traditional folklore with elements of horror, fantasy, and science fiction. These adaptations reflect the enduring fascination with the Strigoi and the ways in which folklore can be adapted to contemporary contexts. The Strigoi have had a significant impact on regional rituals and superstitions throughout Romania. These practices, rooted in the belief in the supernatural, reflect the ways in which folklore has influenced daily life and cultural traditions. One common ritual associated with the Strigoi is the practice of Strigoica, a traditional method of protecting oneself from vampires. This ritual involves placing various protective objects around the home, such as garlic, iron, and holy water. These items are believed to ward off evil spirits and prevent Strigoi from entering the home. The use of garlic and iron in particular reflects the belief that these substances have protective properties against supernatural threats. Another ritual involves the vampire test, a practice used to determine whether someone is a strigoi. This test often involves placing a piece of bread or other food near the suspected vampire's grave. If the food is found to be consumed or disturbed, it is believed to be a sign that the strigoi has risen from the grave. This practice highlights the ways in which folklore has influenced burial customs and the treatment of the deceased. In some regions, the Strigoi are also associated with specific festivals and celebrations. For example, during the Festival of the Dead, participants may perform rituals designed to honor the deceased and protect against supernatural threats. These rituals often include offerings of food and drink, as well as prayers and incantations intended to ensure that the dead remain at peace. Superstitions related to the Strigoi also play a role in everyday life. For example, some people believe that certain behaviors or actions can attract the attention of Strigoi. These superstitions may include avoiding certain places at night, refraining from speaking ill of the dead, or performing specific rituals to ward off evil spirits. These beliefs reflect the pervasive influence of the Strigoi legend on Romanian culture and daily life. The Strigoi legend is part of a broader tradition of vampire folklore that spans various cultures and regions. A comparative analysis of the Strigoi and other vampire legends can provide valuable insights into the common themes and differences in vampire mythology across the world. One key comparison is between the Strigoi and the Western concept of the vampire, popularized by literature and media such as Bram Stoker's Dracula. While the Strigoi are often depicted as revenants or undead spirits with a specific connection to Romanian folklore, Western vampires are frequently portrayed as seductive and immortal beings with the ability to drain blood and manipulate others. Despite these differences, both the Strigoi and Western vampires share common traits, such as their association with death, the supernatural, and their ability to instill fear. In Eastern European folklore, the Strigoi can be compared to the Polish Upior and the Russian Vertilak. Like the Strigoi, these entities are believed to be undead beings that prey on the living. They share similar characteristics, such as their ability to drain blood and their association with malevolent spirits. These similarities reflect a broader regional tradition of vampire mythology that includes common themes and motifs. In other parts of the world, vampire legends also exhibit similarities and differences. For example, in Chinese folklore, the Jiangshu is a type of reanimated corpse that drains the life force of the living. While the Jiangshu is distinct from the Strigoi in its appearance and abilities, both share a common theme of the undead preying on the living. Similarly, in South American folklore, the Chupacabra is a creature that attacks livestock and is sometimes associated with vampiric traits.
religious beliefs have played a significant role in shaping the mythology of the Strigoi. The tension between Christian teachings and older pagan beliefs is evident in the ways the Strigoi have been understood and dealt with in Romanian culture. The church often viewed belief in the Strigoi as a remnant of pre-Christian traditions, but it was forced to address these beliefs due to their strong hold on the populace. In many Romanian communities, the church attempted to Christianize the rituals associated with the Strigoi. For instance, Priests might bless graves or sprinkle holy water on the suspected strigoi to prevent them from rising from the dead. In some cases, the church even sanctioned the use of certain protective measures, like placing a cross or icon on a grave, to reassure the faithful that the strigoi would be kept at bay. However, the strigoi legend also exists in a complex relationship with local superstitions and practices that predate Christianity. These older beliefs often involve rituals and practices that are seen as unorthodox, or even heretical by the church. For example, the act of staking a suspected strigoi through the heart with a wooden stake is a ritual that has pagan roots, emphasizing the importance of preventing the spirit from returning to the body. The strigoi's connection to religious beliefs is also evident in the way they are perceived as damned souls. In some interpretations, the strigoi are seen as spirits that have been denied entrance to heaven due to their sins or improper burial rites. This belief reflects a deep-seated fear of the consequences of living a sinful life or failing to observe proper religious customs. The idea that a person could become a strigoi after death underscores the importance of living a pious life and adhering to religious norms. Moreover, the strigoi legend has been used to explain certain phenomena that the church could not easily address. For example, mysterious deaths, unexplained illnesses, and other misfortunes were sometimes attributed to the malevolent influence of a strigoi. In such cases, the church might be called upon to perform exorcisms or other rituals to protect the community from the perceived threat. This blending of religious and folkloric beliefs highlights the way in which the strigoi legend has been integrated into the spiritual landscape of Romania. As global interest in vampires and the supernatural has grown, the strigoi have found their way into modern pop culture influencing literature, film, television, and even video games. While the Strigoi may not be as widely recognized as other vampire archetypes, their influence is evident in many contemporary works that draw on vampire mythology. In literature, the Strigoi have been featured in both Romanian and international works that explore the darker aspects of vampire lore. Authors have used the Strigoi to delve into themes of death, immortality, and the fear of the unknown. The Strigoi's connection to Romanian folklore and history adds a layer of authenticity and depth to stories that explore these themes. Some writers have also reimagined the Strigoi for modern audiences, blending traditional folklore with contemporary settings and characters. The Strigoi have also appeared in films and television shows that focus on vampires and the supernatural. While these portrayals often take creative liberties, they usually retain some of the key characteristics of the Strigoi, such as their connection to the undead and their ability to rise from the grave. In some cases, the Strigoi are depicted as more monstrous or terrifying than their Western vampire counterparts, emphasizing their roots in ancient primal fears. Video games have also embraced the Strigoi as part of their exploration of vampire lore. In some games, the Strigoi are depicted as powerful enemies or bosses that the player must defeat. These portrayals often draw on the traditional characteristics of the Strigoi, such as their ability to transform into animals or control the undead. The Strigoi's inclusion in video games reflects the broader trend of incorporating diverse vampire myths into popular media. One of the most notable examples of the Strigoi in pop culture is their portrayal in the TV series The Strain, which was co-created by Guillermo del Toro. In this series, the Strigoi are depicted as a terrifying, parasitic race of vampires that threaten humanity. While the show takes creative liberties with the traditional Strigoi myth, it draws heavily on Eastern European vampire folklore and introduces the Strigoi to a global audience. The inclusion of the Strigoi in modern pop culture highlights the enduring appeal of vampire mythology and the ways in which these legends continue to evolve and resonate with contemporary audiences. The Strigoi's journey from Romanian folklore to global pop culture is a testament to the power of these stories and their ability to adapt to new contexts while retaining their core themes and motifs. The Strigoi myth has evolved significantly over the centuries, reflecting changes in Romanian society, culture, and beliefs. 
As Romania has modernized and undergone social and political transformations, the Strigoi legend has adapted to these changes, maintaining its relevance while also reflecting contemporary concerns. One of the key factors in the evolution of the Strigoi myth is the shift from rural to urban life. In traditional rural communities, belief in the Strigoi was deeply ingrained in daily life, with rituals, superstitions, and oral traditions playing a central role in the community's relationship with the supernatural. As Romania has become more urbanized, these traditional beliefs have been challenged by modernity and rationalism. However, the Strigoi myth has not disappeared. Instead, it has been reinterpreted in ways that resonate with modern sensibilities. In urban settings, the Strigoi are often seen as symbolic of the fears and anxieties that come with modern life. The idea of the Strigoi as a malevolent force that disrupts the natural order can be interpreted as a metaphor for the disruptions caused by rapid social and technological change. In this context, the Strigoi represent a connection to the past and a reminder of the dangers that can arise when traditional values and customs are abandoned. The Strigoi myth has also been influenced by Romania's political history, particularly during the communist era. Under the communist regime, folklore and traditional beliefs were often suppressed or reinterpreted to align with the state's ideology. The Strigoi, with their association with death and the supernatural, were sometimes depicted as reactionary forces that threatened the progress of the socialist state. However, even during this period, belief in the Strigoi persisted, often in subtle or covert forms. In contemporary Romania, the Strigoi continue to be a part of the cultural landscape, though their role has shifted. While belief in the Strigoi may not be as widespread as it once was, the legend still holds a place in Romanian culture, particularly in the realm of entertainment and tourism. The Strigoi have become a part of Romania's cultural heritage, attracting interest from both locals and tourists who are fascinated by the country's vampire lore. The evolution of the Strigoi myth reflects the broader changes in Romanian society and culture. As the country has modernized and integrated into the global community, the Strigoi have adapted to these changes, evolving from a feared supernatural entity into a symbol of Romania's rich cultural heritage. This evolution underscores the resilience of folklore and its ability to adapt to changing social and cultural contexts while retaining its core essence. The fear of death is a central theme in the Strigoi legend, as these creatures represent the ultimate perversion of the natural order. The idea of the dead returning to life, not as benevolent spirits, but as malevolent beings that prey on the living, taps into deep-seated fears about mortality and the afterlife. In Romanian culture, the Strigoi embody the fear that death might not bring peace, but rather a continued existence in a twisted, corrupted form. The Strigoi are often seen as restless spirits who were denied a proper burial or who died under tragic or violent circumstances. This belief reflects the importance of burial rites and the need to ensure that the dead are properly honored and laid to rest. In many cases, the rituals associated with the Strigoi are intended to correct perceived wrongs, such as improper burials, that might cause a spirit to become restless and return as a Strigoi. This fear of death and the unknown is further compounded by the belief that the Strigoi can cause harm to the living. In Romanian folklore, the Strigoi are often blamed for a wide range of misfortunes, including illness, crop failures, and even the deaths of loved ones. This attribution of malevolence to the Strigoi reflects a broader anxiety about the power of the dead to influence the world of the living. In this context, the Strigoi serve as a cautionary tale about the importance of respecting the dead and observing proper burial practices. The fear that a loved one could return as a Strigoi if their burial rites are not properly performed underscores the significance of these rituals in Romanian culture. It also highlights the belief that the dead have the potential to influence the living in both positive and negative ways. The Strigoi legend also reflects broader concerns about the afterlife and the possibility of eternal damnation. The idea that a person could become a Strigoi due to their sins or immoral behavior during life suggests that the fear of becoming a Strigoi is linked to fears about what happens after death. In this way, the Strigoi serve as a reminder of the importance of living a virtuous life and observing religious customs to avoid a fate worse than death. Romanian burial customs have been deeply influenced by the fear of the Strigoi, with many practices designed to prevent the dead from returning to life as these malevolent creatures. 
These customs reflect a blend of Christian beliefs and older pagan traditions that emphasize the importance of ensuring that the dead are properly honored and laid to rest. One of the most common practices associated with preventing the rise of a strigoi is the placement of specific items in the coffin or grave. In some regions of Romania, it is customary to place a cross or an icon on the chest of the deceased to protect them from malevolent forces. Other protective items might include garlic, iron nails, or thorny branches, all of which are believed to have the power to ward off evil spirits. Another common practice is to drive a wooden stake through the heart of the deceased, particularly if there are suspicions that they might become a strigoi. This practice is rooted in the belief that the stake will pin the spirit to the body, preventing it from rising from the grave. In some cases, the stake is driven through other parts of the body, such as the stomach or head, to ensure that the strigoi cannot escape. The burial of a suspected strigoi is often accompanied by other rituals intended to prevent their return. For example, in some regions, the grave of a strigoi is dug deeper than usual, and the body may be buried face down to confuse the spirit. In other cases, the grave may be surrounded by a circle of protective herbs or blessed by a priest to ensure that the strigoi cannot escape. These burial customs also reflect the importance of ensuring that the dead are given a proper and respectful burial. The fear that a loved one might return as a strigoi if their burial rites are not properly observed underscores the significance of these rituals in Romanian culture. It also highlights the belief that the dead have the potential to influence the living in both positive and negative ways. The role of burial customs in preventing the rise of the strigoi also underscores the close connection between the living and the dead in Romanian culture. The belief that the dead can return to life and cause harm to the living reflects a broader concern with the boundaries between life and death and the need to maintain these boundaries through proper rituals and practices. While belief in the strigoi may have diminished in modern-day Romania, the legend continues to hold a place in the cultural imagination. In rural areas, where traditional beliefs and practices are still observed, stories of the strigoi persist, often passed down through generations as part of local folklore. Even in urban areas, where modernity and rationalism have taken hold, the strigoi legend continues to resonate as a symbol of Romania's rich cultural heritage. In some communities, the rituals and practices associated with the strigoi are still observed, particularly in times of crisis or when unexplained misfortunes occur. These practices serve as a way to address fears and anxieties that cannot be easily explained by modern science or medicine. For example, if a series of mysterious deaths occur in a village, some residents might still resort to traditional rituals to ensure that the strigoi are not to blame. The strigoi legend has also found new life in Romania's tourism industry, where it is promoted as part of the country's vampire lore. Sites associated with vampire legends, including those connected to the strigoi, attract tourists from around the world who are fascinated by Romania's supernatural heritage. These sites often blend history, folklore, and entertainment, offering visitors a chance to explore the darker side of Romanian culture. The continued interest in the Strigoi also reflects broader trends in global pop culture, where vampires and the supernatural remain popular themes. As Romania has become more integrated into the global community, the Strigoi legend has been reinterpreted and adapted for new audiences. This includes its portrayal in literature, film, and television, where the strigoi are often depicted as a unique and terrifying form of vampire. In modern-day Romania, the strigoi serve as a reminder of the country's rich cultural heritage and the enduring power of folklore. While the legend may have evolved over time, it continues to resonate with Romanians and international audiences alike. The Strigoi's ability to adapt to new contexts while retaining its core essence is a testament to the strength of these stories and their ability to speak to universal fears and concerns. As Romania continues to modernize and change, the Strigoi legend will likely continue to evolve, reflecting the ongoing tension between tradition and modernity. Whether as a symbol of the past or a figure in contemporary pop culture, the Strigoi remain a powerful and enduring part of Romania's cultural landscape. The Strigoi have found a unique place in popular culture, especially within the realm of horror fiction and cinema. While the more well-known vampire legends, such as that of Dracula, have dominated global perceptions of vampires, the Strigoi offer a fresh and terrifying take on the undead. Their origins, 
steeped in Romanian folklore, present a more primal and haunting image of vampirism compared to the often romanticized portrayals found in modern media. In recent years, the Strigoi have been featured in various films, television shows, and books. These portrayals often highlight the Strigoi's connection to the earth and their primal, animalistic nature. Unlike the suave, charismatic vampires of Western literature, the Strigoi are depicted as feral, almost zombie-like creatures driven by an insatiable hunger for blood. This depiction emphasizes their otherworldliness and their link to death and decay. One notable example of the Strigoi in popular culture is the television series, The Strain, based on the novel trilogy by Guillermo del Toro and Chuck Hogan. The series introduces the Strigoi as a vampiric plague, spreading rapidly through modern society. The Strigoi in The Strain are grotesque, terrifying creatures that embody the fear of disease and the collapse of civilization. Their portrayal is a stark contrast to the often romanticized vampires of other media focusing instead on the horror of their existence and the existential threat they pose. The Strigoi have also made appearances in video games, where their folkloric roots are explored in dark, immersive worlds. These portrayals often draw on the traditional imagery of the Strigoi, depicting them as revenants that rise from the grave to terrorize the living. In these games, the Strigoi are often formidable enemies, requiring players to use both skill and strategy to defeat them. Their inclusion in these games underscores the enduring appeal of vampire legends and the Strigoi's unique place within that tradition. In literature, the Strigoi continue to inspire authors who seek to explore the darker aspects of vampire mythology. Novels that feature the Strigoi often delve into themes of death, decay, and the fear of the unknown. These stories typically focus on the Strigoi's role as a harbinger of doom, a creature that brings chaos and destruction wherever it goes. By exploring these themes, authors are able to tap into deep-seated fears about mortality and the afterlife, making the Strigoi a compelling and terrifying figure in contemporary horror. Despite their growing presence in popular culture, the Strigoi remain relatively unknown compared to other vampire legends. However, this relative obscurity only adds to their mystique, making them a fascinating subject for those interested in exploring the darker corners of vampire mythology. As interest in global folklore continues to grow, it is likely that the Strigoi will become more prominent in popular culture, offering new and terrifying stories for audiences to enjoy. The Strigoi legend, like many other folkloric tales, has evolved over time, adapting to the changing cultural and social landscape of Romania. While the core elements of the legend, revenants rising from the grave to prey on the living, have remained consistent, the ways in which the Strigoi are perceived and represented have shifted in response to broader societal changes. One of the most significant changes in the Strigoi legend is the shift from a rural, agrarian context to an urban modern one. In the past, the Strigoi were closely associated with rural communities, where traditional beliefs and practices were deeply rooted in the natural world. The Strigoi were seen as a threat to these communities, representing the dangers of the unknown and the supernatural. Rituals and practices designed to ward off the Strigoi were an integral part of rural life, reflecting the close relationship between the living and the dead in these communities. As Romania has modernized and urbanized, the Strigoi legend has adapted to reflect these changes. In urban settings, the Strigoi are often depicted as more elusive and insidious, blending into the anonymity of city life. This shift mirrors broader anxieties about the loss of community and the increasing alienation of modern life. The Strigoi, once a visible and tangible threat in rural communities, have become a more abstract and psychological menace in urban settings. The Strigoi legend has also been influenced by Romania's complex history, including periods of political and social upheaval. During times of crisis, such as the communist era, the Strigoi were sometimes invoked as symbols of resistance or defiance against oppressive regimes. In this context, the Strigoi represented the persistence of traditional beliefs and practices in the face of attempts to suppress them. The legend served as a reminder of Romania's cultural heritage and the enduring power of folklore. In the post-communist era, the Strigoi have continued to evolve, reflecting Romania's integration into the global community. As Romanian culture has become more interconnected with the rest of the world, the Strigoi legend has been reinterpreted and reimagined in new ways. This includes its incorporation into global pop culture, 
where the Strigoi are often depicted as a unique and terrifying form of vampire. At the same time, the legend has retained its distinct Romanian character, serving as a symbol of the country's rich cultural heritage. The evolution of the Strigoi legend also reflects broader changes in the way that folklore is understood and appreciated. In the past, folklore was often seen as a static, unchanging tradition, passed down from generation to generation without alteration. However, contemporary scholars recognize that folklore is a dynamic and adaptive cultural phenomenon, constantly evolving in response to new circumstances and challenges. The Strigoi legend is a prime example of this adaptability demonstrating how folklore can remain relevant and meaningful even in a rapidly changing world. In modern-day Romania, belief in the Strigoi varies widely depending on the region, age, and cultural background of individuals. While many Romanians view the Strigoi as a relic of the past, a fascinating but ultimately fictional aspect of their cultural heritage, others continue to take these legends seriously, particularly in rural areas where traditional beliefs still hold sway. In some rural communities, the fear of the Strigoi remains a potent force, influencing daily life and practices. For example, in certain regions, it is still common to perform rituals and ceremonies to protect against the Strigoi, particularly during times of crisis or when misfortunes occur. These practices are often tied to specific times of the year, such as All Souls Day, when the boundaries between the living and the dead are believed to be at their thinnest. During these times, it is customary to perform rituals to ensure that the dead are at peace and cannot return as Strigoi. These beliefs are often passed down through generations, with older members of the community serving as keepers of tradition. In these communities, stories of the Strigoi are told to younger generations as cautionary tales, reinforcing the importance of respecting the dead and observing proper burial rites. The Strigoi serve as a reminder of the dangers that can arise when the natural order is disrupted, and they underscore the importance of maintaining the delicate balance between the living and the dead. In urban areas, belief in the Strigoi is less common, but the legend continues to hold a place in the cultural imagination. Even those who do not believe in the literal existence of the Strigoi often view them as a symbol of Romania's rich cultural heritage. The Strigoi are seen as a connection to the past, a reminder of the country's deep roots in folklore and mythology. For many Romanians, the Strigoi are a source of pride, representing a unique and distinctive aspect of their national identity. The continued belief in the Strigoi also reflects broader trends in global spirituality, where interest in the supernatural and the paranormal has seen a resurgence in recent years. As more people seek out alternative forms of spirituality and explore non-traditional beliefs, the Strigoi have found new relevance as part of this global movement. For some, the Strigoi represent a way to connect with the past and explore the mysteries of life and death in a modern context. In this way, the Strigoi legend continues to evolve, adapting to the changing beliefs and values of modern society. Whether as a literal belief, a cultural symbol, or a subject of fascination, the Strigoi remain an enduring part of Romania's cultural landscape offering insights into the country's history, folklore, and identity. Throughout Romanian history, the fear of Strigoi has given rise to a variety of rituals and protective measures aimed at keeping these malevolent spirits at bay. These practices, deeply rooted in local folklore and traditions, offer a fascinating glimpse into the ways in which communities sought to protect themselves from the undead. One of the most well-known rituals associated with the Strigoi involves the treatment of the deceased's body to prevent it from rising from the grave. In some regions of Romania, it was customary to bury the dead with specific precautions to ensure they would not return as Strigoi. For example, some would place iron nails in the coffin or drive a stake through the heart of the deceased to pin them to the earth. These measures were believed to prevent the body from rising and to keep the Strigoi trapped in their grave. Another common practice was to place certain objects in the coffin that were thought to deter the Strigoi. Garlic, known for its supposed ability to ward off evil, was often placed in the coffin or around the grave. A thorny rose bush might also be planted on the grave, as it was believed that the Strigoi could not pass through thorns. These protective measures were seen as essential for ensuring that the deceased would rest peacefully and not return to torment the living. In addition to these burial practices, various rituals were performed to protect the living from the Strigoi. One such ritual was the Night Watch, 
where villagers would gather at the grave of a recently deceased person suspected of being a Strigoi. They would stay up all night, keeping vigil to ensure that the body did not rise. If any signs of Strigoi activity were observed, such as the grave being disturbed or strange noises being heard, the villagers would take immediate action, often by exhuming the body and performing additional protective measures. Certain times of the year were also believed to be more dangerous, as the veil between the living and the dead was thought to be thinner. On these occasions, special precautions were taken to protect against the Strigoi. During the night of St. Andrew, for example, it was believed that the Strigoi were particularly active, and people would stay indoors, rubbing garlic on doors and windows to keep the evil spirits out. This night, known as the Night of the Strigoi, was a time of heightened vigilance and fear, as the Strigoi were believed to roam freely, searching for victims. In addition to these protective measures, some individuals were believed to possess the ability to detect or combat the Strigoi. These individuals, often known as Strigoi hunters or witches, were called upon in times of need to rid the community of the Strigoi's influence. They would perform rituals, cast spells, and use various talismans to protect the community and banish the Strigoi. These figures held a respected and sometimes feared position within the community, as they were believed to possess knowledge and power beyond that of ordinary people. These rituals and protective measures reflect the deep-seated fear of the Strigoi in Romanian culture. They offer insights into the ways in which communities sought to control and mitigate the influence of the supernatural. Using a combination of folk wisdom, ritual practices, and communal effort to protect themselves from the undead. As Romania has transitioned into the modern era, the Strigoi have taken on a new role as both a symbol of cultural heritage and a subject of fascination in the global context. The evolution of the Strigoi legend, from a deeply feared supernatural threat to a symbol of Romanian identity, underscores the enduring power of folklore and its ability to adapt to changing times. In contemporary Romania, the Strigoi are often viewed through the lens of cultural history, serving as a connection to the country's rural past and its rich tradition of storytelling. While belief in the literal existence of the Strigoi has waned, the legend itself remains a potent cultural symbol. For many Romanians, the Strigoi represent a link to their ancestors, a reminder of the beliefs and practices that shaped their communities for centuries. The Strigoi have become a point of pride, representing Romania's unique contribution to the broader tapestry of European folklore. The Strigoi legend has also found new life in the context of Romania's tourism industry, where it is often marketed as part of the country's rich cultural heritage. Visitors to Romania are frequently drawn to the country's vampire legends, with the Strigoi playing a key role in this narrative. Tours and attractions centered around the Strigoi and other vampire legends offer visitors a chance to explore Romania's folklore in a tangible way, visiting historic sites and learning about the rituals and beliefs associated with the Strigoi. In this context, the Strigoi serve as a bridge between the past and the present, connecting modern Romanians with their cultural roots while also appealing to a global audience. The legend of the Strigoi has become a way for Romania to assert its cultural identity on the world stage, offering a unique and compelling narrative that distinguishes it from other countries. The Strigoi's role in popular culture, particularly in films and literature, has further solidified their place as a symbol of Romania's rich folkloric tradition. The Strigoi also play a role in Romania's national identity, serving as a reminder of the country's resilience in the face of adversity. The Strigoi, with their association with death, decay, and the afterlife, reflect the challenges that Romania has faced throughout its history. The country's ability to preserve and adapt these legends, even in the face of modernization and globalization, speaks to the strength of Romanian culture and its capacity to endure. At the same time, the Strigoi have become a symbol of the ongoing tension between tradition and modernity in Romania. As the country continues to evolve, balancing its rich cultural heritage with the demands of a rapidly changing world, the Strigoi serve as a reminder of the importance of preserving the past while embracing the future. This tension is reflected in the way the Strigoi are portrayed in modern media, where they are often depicted as creatures caught between two worlds, one foot in the past, the other in the present. In this way, the Strigoi have transcended their origins as a feared supernatural entity to become a multifaceted symbol of Romanian identity. 
They represent the enduring power of folklore, the resilience of cultural traditions, and the complex relationship between the past and the present. As Romania continues to navigate the challenges of the modern world, the Strigoi will likely remain a powerful and enduring symbol of the country's rich cultural heritage.